All right, coming up next, this highly anticipated matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. So here he is, the number one middleweight contender getting set for this 185 pound title fight. He believes this title shot should have come a long time ago. But he has let bygones be bygones. The focus now, unseating the champion in dominant fashion and starting a new middleweight legacy of his own. 25 minutes or fewer away from becoming the new champion. We will see how he performs tonight. So here he is, the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world. This man ubiquitously regarded as the top 85er at present. Some people believe this is the greatest middleweight of all time. He certainly does, and he has goals even beyond that. He wants to be one of the greatest mixed martial arts athletes of all time. And in order to preserve that goal, this is a title defense, simply put, that he's got to have. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Adesanya is five years the elder. He will have a five-inch reach advantage. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment you all been waiting for live from the sold out arena in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 12 wins, no losses. He stands 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Stockholm, Sweden, presenting the challenger, Hamzat Bors Chibaya. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 24 wins, 2 losses. He stands 6 feet 4 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world, Israel, the last style bender. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. other's radars for quite some time. Tonight, it shall be done. Both guys well-rounded. You think you're getting a kickboxing match tonight or what? You just don't know, right? You don't know who's going to be able to employ their strategy the way that they need to. This is a close fight on paper and also in every performance we have seen them put on. These guys seem to be the mirror image of each other. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. See a lot of options at his disposal from here. Now the guy's got on bar. He's attacking it on him. And attacking on bar. You 
got to recognize that when a guy starts to put his feet on your hips, you got to move him off, and you got to cover. You can't be off to an angle. And this might just be a matter of time. Somehow stays in the fight. All right, full guard here, DC. We'll see how soon he tries to pass. Well, he needs to be passed immediately. Whoa! Whoa! Isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motions on the mat. Oh! oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He loaded up there on that high kick. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Oh, nice job to get takedown land. So he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Let's go. Get him off. Get him off. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in next Now he'll try to start attacking a rear naked choke from the top position. He is doing a really good job of relaxing, not panicking because he's getting choked. Yeah, notice he just took the body triangle, readjust the lock, and now it looks like he's got it. And there it is! He's done, he's done! What a performance! Right, I mean, how do you not admire the focus of this young fighter? You could tell he was looking for that submission much earlier in the round, but he didn't want to rush it. He stayed patient, let the setup do its thing, and ultimately the submission materializes organically late in the round. High-level stuff out of that young fighter here tonight. There on the ground, DC, talk us through the huddle. He's such a phenomenal grappler. I don't understand how people don't know that this guy wants to submit you. He is the best grappler, best submission specialist we've seen in a long time. Well, you're going to have to be pretty perfect to get this guy off the throne. There he is, the UFC's undisputed middleweight champion. Complete performance here tonight. And it ends with a win by way of submission. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop this contest at 4 minutes, 17 seconds in the very first round. For the winner by submission and still. And still the undisputed UFC middleweight champion and with style points tonight. How about the best 185 pounder in the world submitting the number one contender here tonight? And I'm not sure I've seen him celebrate a win quite to the extent to which he is right now, embracing his coaches. They might even bring the family in here at one point in time. This is a huge win.